New at 10 with the upcoming school year starting soon, Sacramento High School has launched a new campaign to raise money for a new football field and athletic facilities. Fox 40's Garsh Paul Sanga joining us live outside Sac High with the issues they're facing and Garsh Paul, what forced them to start that campaign? Eric, there are a lot of issues and it's going to take a lot of money to fix all those issues. Now, the team here at Sac High and a nonprofit are hoping to begin somewhere a start to make things better. Come on, let's get to our spot. Right, High school football is underway. <laughs> Kids are working real hard, real dedicated. Sacramento High School Dragons coming off of a winning season. Oh, that's the one I needed. And hoping for another. For us, it's just trying to build pride, tradition, trying to build it up so the kids can have some, you know, something to fight for. With every practice. Ooh, let it go. There you go. Look at that. For Coach Kimmy Drayton and his team, it's an uphill climb to attain that success. We're practicing here and there's no line, no football lines to practice at. And depending on where you stand on the field, there's dead grass, dibbits, and even weeds. Their lockers are the same lockers I went here in 01. Nothing has changed. Sacramento High School is the second oldest public school in California, and the scoreboard doesn't look a day older. Why not us? Why can't we get the same thing that every other school gets? What makes our kids at Sac High any different than the other kids? West Campus has a turf field and doesn't have a football team. Johnson has a turf field. McClatchy has a turf field. Florin has a turf field. Everybody else is second to fight turf field but us. On top of the field issues, some of these games have had to be canceled or rescheduled because the field tends to flood. And also, what's even worse is sometimes they're canceled because they just don't have enough seats. I'm not surprised. We always get left behind. Julius right. Douglas played on this field a decade ago. His Oak Park nonprofit sees the moment is teaming up to raise money through GoFundMe to upgrade the field and athletic facilities. I just feel like the kids need some a better field to play on. Other high schools got one, so why not sack high? Why are we getting overlooked? Why are we getting left out? Douglas says he was tired of waiting for others to fix the problem. Down. Set. <laughs> just like their dedication at practice, they plan to carry that onto the field. We're just trying to do what we can, you know, make this as comfortable as we can for the student athletes we have. And their first home game is about a month away and the community and the team is going to be hosting a cleanup event. That's going to be next Saturday at 10 a.m. They're asking for volunteers and for people to bring their garden tools. Now, if you want to donate to their GoFundMe page, you can find that under this story on Fox40.com. Reporting live in Sacramento, I'm Garge Paul Sunga, Fox40 News.